There's a lot of boating apps available for navigation. So we wanted to tell you about a free app that we've been using. We'll tell you how we used it on some of our recent boat trips and even get a quick interview with the developer to find out more. This is not a paid video. I'm a brand ambassador sharing my experiences. Hey, it's Diane with My Boat Life. So we've been doing a lot of cruising this summer. Uh, going on a lot of fun trips across the Chesapeake Bay. Um, some of the longest trips we've actually been able to go on for like our 20 years of boating. Um, and this summer we decided to try something new with um, our navigation. We're using a new app called Argo. Um, it's Argo Navigation on the App Store and uh, you can also use it on Android phones. You can use it on your phone or you can use it on a tablet. Um, right now we've been using it on the phone, um, but we're thinking about next season maybe setting up a tablet at our helm so that we can see an even bigger screen while we're cruising. So it's a free app, you download it, and you set up your profile, um, and you put in your boat draft information, you put in your average cruising speed, your average fuel consumption, and you search for your, your destination and it will auto route based on your boat's draft. So when we did our cruise this summer, um, we did, you know, a pretty big cruise for us all the way down to uh, Cambridge, Maryland from uh, Georgetown, Maryland on the Sassafras. And it was about a four hour cruise and we used Argo the whole way. Um, and it sent us, you know, through safe waters based on the draft information that we had. And it pulls in uh, depth layers that um, have NOAA and US Army Corps of Engineer depth numbers. And then you're always going to be in, you know, enough water for whatever your boat's draft and whatever your comfort zone is for, um, you know, a buffer above the draft. So we used it um, for multiple trips. And the cool thing about it is, you know, you have it on your phone and while you're home, I mean, we live about an hour and a half from the boat. So when we're home, we can figure out where we're going, um, plan the trip. And it was, you know, four different legs of our trip. So I had each voyage saved separately. And then when we were ready to go, you know, I just hit start and we're watching the, the route and we're following it the whole way. Um, and, you know, it tells you how long it's going to take to get there. So, you know, your ETA and you know how much um, average fuel consumption is going to be based on your burn rate for your boat. Um, and then at the end of the trip, you save it and you've got a whole captain's log that you have, you know, with all the details from the trip and how long it took you to get there and how many miles and how much fuel consumption. Um, so it's really cool to save it. The other thing we've been doing is we're starting to get some friends that are using the app too, which is kind of cool because we can see them on the water. Um, you know, once you are connected with different friends that are using the app, you'll be able to see where they are on the water and you can meet up for a raft up. Um, you can also message them and chat. So I've got several friends that we've started chatting through the app. Um, and you know, it's just all boating stuff and talking about trips and places we're going or planning to go to. So it's kind of fun to do that through the app also. Um, so check it out. Uh, you know, I was at the Annapolis Powerboat Show recently and had a chance to chat with the founder of the app. He's out of Haver de Grace, Maryland. Um, he's been boating on the Chesapeake Bay for, you know, his whole life and had this idea to develop the app. So started it a couple of years ago and it's, you know, really starting to uh, grow and get popular. Um, so anyway, I chatted with the founder of Argo at the Annapolis Boat Show and asked him a few more questions about it. So I'm here at the Argo booth at the Annapolis Boat Show and I'm going to talk to the founder of Argo, which is a navigation and social boating app.
Hi, I'm Captain Jeff, founder of the Argo Boating App. It's an easy to use navigation and social app. So, um, what inspired you to create Argo? I just felt there could be an easier way of, uh, of navigating the waters, something that's uh, similar to a car that you can just pick a destination where you want to go, create a route, see uh, hazards and other things along the way, connect with other boaters. And how long has Argo been around? Argo has been out for two years. We uh, released it uh, in September and uh, it's grown from us a couple hundred users to now we have nearly 50,000 downloads. So it's, wow. it's really grown over the last two years. Yeah, that's a lot of users. And uh, what kind of coverage does Argo have? Well, Argo works anywhere in the U.S., Canada, down into the Caribbean. So anywhere pretty much in North America it works. Uh, relies on the NOAA depth data as well as the Army Corps of Engineers. So, But the features work anywhere. Of the Argo app. Oh, well, navigation like is like I one. said, navigation is the big one. It's really got solid navigation, yeah. but it does have a social aspect in the sense you can drop pins so that other voters can see hazards that maybe you came across. Uh, you can also add your friends and see them more easily. You can see any Argo user on the water, but you can see your friends more easily. You can connect with them, message them, also share either your voyages and trips that you've taken or just experiences with pictures and things like that so there's really a, a social aspect to it yeah and i was saying that i was using the app all summer with my trips and one of the things that i use a lot is the captain's log it does have a, a captain's log so you can plan your routes at home save them and then when you get ready to get out on the water in your boat you can retake those routes that you've planned out and then obviously save your voyage from that trip and even retake a voyage later on as well. Cool. And so is it just for power boaters or what kind of boaters are you using Argo? Um, Argo is for just about any boater. Uh, whether you're a power boater, sail boater, whether you're a recreation, whether you're uh, a novice or an experience, whether you want to cruise the Great Loop or uh, it, it really truly, it tells boaters kind of what's out there where they can go what other boaters are seeing so there's a real crowdsource piece to it and in addition to like i said the, the navigation piece yeah okay so some people have other apps out there uh, a lot of people wonder like well how is this different than apps like navionics there are a lot of apps in the in, the, in this marine space and uh it is similar to navionics in the sense that it has the auto routing uh, very fast, but but Argo is very clean interface. It's very easy to use. A lot of our newer users really love it for that reason. But even some of the actually quite a few of the Navionics users like it for that reason as well. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles, but very easy to use. Very quick, accurate auto routes. Yeah, and also it's free. Free to use. It, it is free to download, free to use, uh, that is true. Uh, that is one good thing, it's yeah. no cost at all. It nice. doesn't cost you to try it out. So I've been using it on my phone, but you can also use it on tablet? You can, you can, it works on iOS and Android, phones and tablets, iPads. Uh, you can actually have your phone and your, uh, your tablet and they both work at the same time. Cool, sounds good. Yeah, thank you, Diane. Hope you like this video and subscribe for more from My Boat Life.